Well, happening now, the Beechwood High School community is celebrating the life of freshman Mason Bushelman. The 16 year old died yesterday from a catastrophic seizure disorder. Nine on your side's Ashley Zilka is live at the high school with this young man's story. Ashley. Well, Mason's friends and family tell me his illness never stopped him. He was a football player and a fixture at this school. For the second time this week, the community will come together to mourn Mason here at this football field. Now his family tells nine on your side he had Dravet syndrome, a lifelong form of epilepsy that causes frequent and prolonged seizures. He went into cardiac arrest after a seizure earlier this week and died at the hospital last night. His football coach and teachers say Mason was one of a kind. His love and pride for Beechwood contagious. Both on and off the football field at Beechwood, he was uh, liked. He was um, somewhat admired from the standpoint of he got along with everybody and um, everybody was always there to help him and you know that was that was the thing that was unique. Mason loved Beechwood so much that on our way back from some of our trips he would make us sing the Beechwood fight song every time we hit Beechwood Road. Even if we didn't know the words we were still singing that as loud as we could no matter what and he just that's Mason. He loved his community, he loves his family, he loves his school. Probably the biggest school spirit I've ever seen. Now tonight's vigil will be in about an hour here at Beechwood High School. His family and friends say Mason would not want people to be sad, and that's why tonight is a celebration. Reporting live, Ashley Zilka, 9 on your side.